Hi guys and welcome back to another squad builder by myself Bates and 87 today we are doing the 4040 squad builder this is a team which a professional FIFA player was able to get 40 wins out of 40 attempts in the foot champions at the weekend it was only done by one person over two consoles so PlayStation um, got the 40 out of 40 Xbox never got the 40 out of 40 I think the closest was 39 and uh, today we're looking at a team that the guy did use um, to potentially um, well, he did. He finished number one and will be getting the super, super rewards um, when they are released. So the team itself, guys, is a very, very interesting one. We're going to be taking a look at it, guys. He's not giving away the player instructions. He's not giving away the custom tactics. But remember, this is a team which he used. He is a quality FIFA player. He puts a lot of time and effort into getting good at the game. A lot like Gorilla, how every um, professional FIFA player gets good at the game. But we're just showing um, how the team worked for him whether it can work for me, and uh, unfortunately you won't be able to use this team in the weekend league coming up, just because there is a stipulation where you can only use six players from one league um, as a max. Uh, within the uh, weekend league so if you guys do want any MSP PSN codes or cheap game codes go and check out g 2 edcom their link is down below if you're trying to hit up 5,000 likes that'd be absolutely awesome and guys subscribe if you're not subscribed already I will also leave the link to the Canadian pro player down below in the description guys so you guys go and drop him a follow on Twitter uh, so you can keep an eye on his progress during foot champions so we're starting off with a team. One player is incorrect, guys, and that is obviously Higuain. Higuain, he does have his normal card, but the rest of the, the team are the same. I think even Raphael, he may have as straight as a, as a centre-forward as he comes out of packs. But the team itself, guys, is a full Bundesliga team. It's a very, very nice-looking Bundesliga team. In the goalkeeper position, he doesn't go with a 92-rated Neuer. He goes with the 86-rated Leno with basic chem style as well. Now... I will show you the instructions that he does have for the defence, and that's just the same apart from uh, uh, stay back while attack, and he always has a stay back while attack on the CDM as well. And the centre back position on the left hand side, he does have Socrates, um, obviously seen as a, an overpowered defender with Shadow Chem Stalin as well, 78 pace, 85 defending, 83 physical. And then next to him, guys, he does have Toprak with a Shadow Chem style on as well. They may actually be the other way around. I'm not 100% sure. Um, but he does have them two as the two centre-backs. In the right-back position, he has the uh, 82 rated pitch check. Quite a little bit expensive, actually. 8, 79 pace, 81 defending, 80 physical shadow chem style as well. And then on the left-hand side, he has another left-back. Which is none other than not Alaba, it's actually Rodriguez from Wolfsburg, the Swiss international with a shadow chem style as well. So the chem styles are the same on every player which he did use, guys, and even position as well. The only one I did say was Higuain, and he does bronze bench also to bring the rating down. In the CDM position, he goes with a very, very good CDM, which is Luis Gustavo from Wolfsburg also. Um, you guys will probably use him as you go to CDM in the Bundesliga, as I know a majority of people do. On the right-hand side, he does have an 87-rated player, which is Arturo Vidal. 77 pace, 79 dribbling, 81 shooting, 84 defending, 84 physical, 80 passing. And uh, a card which I actively did use at the start of FIFA. On the other side, he does have Thiago from uh, from uh, from FC Bayern as well, um, the Spanish international with five star skills 72 pace 89 dribbling 82 passing and uh, if i have mixed anything up guys i will swap them around towards the end of the video uh, just so you can see the active uh, formation and active positions of each player in the right wing position he actually has a right forward so maybe he might have been testing out another formation but he has a right forward and it is bellarabi Moved up from a right midfield to a right wing, obviously, to play it in this formation. Um, with a sniper chem style as well. He has basic on um, Vidal as well, I forgot to point that out. Uh, but Bellarabi with his 90 pace, 77 shooting, which has been upped. 85 dribbling, which has been upped as well. And 65 physical. On the left wing position, he doesn't go with um, uh, like, a, like a Ribéry or uh, Douglas Costa or even a Royce. He goes with Corman, the 81 rated left wing from France. And 93 pace, 76 shooting, upped. 74 passing, upped. And 84 dribbling, upped as well with the maestro chem style and the final player guys that he did have within the team is a strange choice of a striker but a one which can work a, a hell of a lot as well it is Thomas Muller from Bayern Munich 78 pace 78 dribbling 83 shooting and 77 passing 72 uh, physical with the sniper chem style as well obviously he has got the up stats of shooting and dribbling as well um, but I presume he's going to use him as a target man to let these two run past but it's a team I'm going to try out for you guys today to see how it does play whether you guys can maybe buy it to Take it into divisions, take it into whatever. Um, but unfortunately, you can't use it for this weekend's weekend league um, coming up. So, 
Nice looking team for sure. Um, let's get into the highlights we get with it, guys. I am going to check actually before we do um, if the players are in the correct positions. So the only mistake I made, guys, was Toprak and uh, Socrates has swapped around. Uh, so that's how it does look within the game itself. He could change the formation in game, but this is what he does start out with. And if you guys have used a similar team or seen this team before and used it, let me know what you do think. So leave a like rating, guys. Subscribe if you're not. I'm looking forward to the Foot Champions Weekend League for sure. Hopefully you guys are as well. So leave a like rating the video, subscribe if you're not, and let's go and get into the highlights. We did manage to get with this 40-40 team. So guys, we are here with a team, a team which I struggled with. Yes, it was very, very strange. A very solid team. Um on paper, looked very good. Obviously, I'm not set up with his instructions. I'm not set up with uh, the way he plays. And uh, fair play to him, guys. I was honestly struggling. I was playing in Division 4, trying to get myself up, uh, as I'm still pushing towards getting to Division 1. Um, but it was a frustrating, uh, frustrating period of time with this team, conceding goals left, right and centre. Um, players pushing up when they shouldn't have been pushing up. But it's a team which I fair, fair play to the guy who did win 40 out of 40. I can't take any way, anything away from the team because, um, obviously, it's a proven team. It's won someone the uh, draft champs, uh, but individually, guys, the players. Uh, Luis Gustavo likes to push up, um, even though I do have him set to stay back like uh, like the guy did. But uh, for some reason, it just wasn't working for me. He just kept pushing up, and uh, I was just too too trigger happy uh, with doing the one twos, which obviously cost you a lot of goals. But when we actually got used to the game and a few games where we did completely dominate on the counter attack this team was deadly Corman uh, in front of goal is clinical Muller as well is very very good with his head and you guys do know I'm trying to adapt the crossing style of play into my uh, thing because it'll get me one or two extra goals and maybe even one or two extra wins uh, Vidal Got a decent double tap shot from outside the area. Same with Thiago who's got a really good finesse as well. Uh, wasn't really doing many, many skills so I was trying to try and like imitate the way he was playing. Now, if you guys do watch pro players, they hold possession very, very well. They pass well. They open up routes well, and uh, basically try and abuse the mechanics of inside the game. And that's not a negative thing because that's what's going to win a pro player some money. So fair enough. Uh, but obviously, we're not at that stage of FIFA uh, where the FIFA YouTubers like myself are still getting used to the way the game plays. Getting there a little bit better, but uh, this team was a very, very hard team for me to get used to, and uh, a team which unfortunately no one can use in the upcoming weekend league so it'll be interesting to see if he is able to go 40-40 again and whether you guys would rock with a team like this if you can afford a team like this um, to try and win yourself the number one spot in uh, in foot champions for the weekend but it was nice to try something different out from, from the unusual uh, from the usual sorry and this is uh, obviously I would have put like, the elite players in the Bundesliga but he had players in there which I probably want to use, Corman being one of them um, maybe even a totally different defence and I probably would have gone Lam over Pischer but um, this is a proven team which has gone 40 and 40 in foot champions and uh, obviously won him a hell of a lot of money so I'll be interested to see what he does get from his rewards and like I said guys you go and drop him a follow on Twitter and uh, keep an eye out if he does post his rewards on there so leave a like and subscribe now back again another day another day for you guys to enjoy